So this is, this is Super Mario Bros. 2, but a remake for the Game Boy Advance. Let's go. Choose a game. Super Mario. This is a, so, this is a remake of Super Mario, oh. I'll get rid of my first file. So we're starting to fresh. This is a remake of Super Mario uh, Bros. 2 on the Super Mario All-Stars for the Super NES, which itself is a remake of Super Mario Bros. 2, um, the American version, which itself is a remake of Doki Doki Panic from Japan. So this is a remake of a remake of a remake of a, re of a game. It's fantastic. So I can play as four different characters. Mario, Luigi... Toad's super fast and powerful, but he has bad jump. I I like Mario. Mario's great. This is not gonna be a hundred percent player, it's just gonna be a blind. Love the music. Oh, I just read hang on. My laptop is kind of blocking part of my TV screen. I didn't really notice it for Crazy Taxi, but for this, I'm, for Mario, I'm going to want to see every part of the screen. Oh, hi there. Oh, Ace Coin just lying out. Cool. So this plays very different from every other Mario game. Also, <laughs> this is the Mario game that introduced us to Birdo and Shy Guys and Pow Blocks. Which is pretty great. I'm at least happy to have Shy Guys. Uh-oh. <laughs> Just what I needed! Mario makes bread. Lucky! <laughs> oh, that's it. Oh boy, if you get five of the cherries, you get an invincibility, so that's nice. The levels in this are just so long. I need a turnip or a bomb to blow that up. What a tasty treat! If I bring this back down, come on. Come on, Mario. Come on. Just fall down. Just fall down. Why will he not fall down? Wait. Hey, on! How come that kills me? There's a room right below it! I saw the room right but That's bogus. You have to slide down on the vine, otherwise it doesn't count. That's really stupid. Have to throw free things at it. But... Oh, there is free things in here. Okay. There we go. Well, I'm glad I got the one-up after dying. <laughs> kind of defeating the purpose of the one-up. Whoop! Didn't time that right. Okay. Darn it. I want to see what's in that door, though. It's been a while since I've played this, so I probably know what's in the door, but I just forgot. Because I, I hope it all grows back. It does. Cool. Alright, let's get Shy Guy out of here, for starters. Cool. Oh, is this the boss room? Oh, this is a shortcut to the boss room. I see. Hey, Birdo. This is as far as you go. She's the first boss. There are a lot of boss fights in this. Oh, mia. 
Okay, the eggs can hit you after they ricochet off the wall. That's good to know. Also, I suck at this game, just so if co people couldn't tell. That was a great fro, Mario. A plus. I know it's my fro because I'm the one controlling Mario. But... <laughs> a crystal! And now we enter a hawk's mouth, which for some reason makes us clear the course. This is a weird game. Oh, I did not even come close to getting all the ace coins on that one. Oh well. Do I want to still be Mario? Luigi could be. Let's give Luigi a try. Luigi's better at jumping. This is my magic carpet now. Oh. Either the magic carpet controls weirdly or Luigi controls weirdly. Oh yeah, Luigi was the right choice. <laughs> Did, I think I just cheesed through a huge part of the level. I'm at the boss or yeah, okay. <laughs> Luigi was a good, good choice for this. <laughs> yeah, that's right, Nessie, you speedrun this game, don't you? Or at least on the, the NES version. I like the cartoony voices in this. Darn it, Luigi. Well, the Mario Bros. have an awful throwing arm. Even I have a better throwing arm than them, and that's insulting to the Mario Bros. No! I both like and dislike Luigi's jumping. I like that it skipped, like, all the level for me. I don't like how... Come on. Oh, you lost interest. That's fine. I lost interest in Mega Man Rock Force speedrunning, so... Come on! <laughs> um, that absolutely should have hit Birdo and killed her. Also, we killed Birdo on the last course, so why is she back? Did he just say, now I'm a movie? No, 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 no. We missed one ace coin. Oh well. Okay, this time... Let's go with Mario. This is a boss level, like a big boss level, so I don't really want Luigi on that. Because he did not do very well on the last boss level. For the boss itself. I don't want to do Toad, because he's just not good enough at jumping, even though he's great against the bosses. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> I feel like there's just a tiny little bit of lag on this controller, because I swear I pushed a jump, but... Oh well. No use dwelling on that. Let's continue. Oh, stupid sniffets. Red Shy Guys walk off the cliff. Remember that, Artie. <laughs> Define good times in Rock Force, Nessie, because my best time in that is like 45 minutes. Come on! No, like 50 minutes. Why am I so bad at this? This is World 1! I've already died a ton, because I've gotten a ton of 1-ups. No, 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 no. That's pretty good. 57 minutes. That's pretty good. Why do I suck so bad? This isn't even the hard part of the level. We haven't even gotten to the dungeon yet. Forget the invincibility. It's more trouble than it's worth.
We should just stick with the Smash Bros. stage. <laughs> Lucky! No, 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 no. Mm -mm. Wait, stop it. Stop falling, Mario. The, ga the, the characters are slippery. Not Especially Luigi, but even Mario is. Thank you, Heart Radish. Oh boy, and now for everyone's favorite gimmick, the keys. Pick up the keys and the masks are gonna follow you. It's a cool gimmick, but also terrifying. Because of how relentless they are. Also, I don't remember how far down it's... okay. Thankfully, you can throw the key to get them off your trail for a little bit. No, no, no. Oh. Oh! Glitches for the win! Glitches for the win. I don't think that was supposed to happen. Oh, no! Also, the invincibility avoids you, and I don't... Oh, come on! He always jumps at the worst time! Always jumps at the worst time. Okay, at least we're at the boss now. Please let me in, Hawkmouth. This is the first real boss, Mauser. Not to be confused with Bowser. Bosses have so, such great sound effects, though, in this. Okay, I thought I landed on the blue Lego, but maybe not. I'm down to one life! How do people have, like, 30 lives at the end of the first world? It doesn't make sense. Actually, it does. It's called, they're good at the game, and I'm not. <laughs> Goodbye, Mauser. Oh, what? There we go. I actually do like the boss fights in this until you get to World 3. The World 3 boss is really stupidly hard. No problem, Mario. You died like eight times. I, I don't think that's a no problem. <laughs> okay. Um. We haven't tried out Peach yet. Let's try out Peach. Oh yeah, we're in the desert world. That's right. Because Peach can hover. Although Peach can barely jump. There are Koopa shells on this. I forgot about that. Mushroom! Yay! I was waiting for that potion door. The mushrooms can increase your max HP, which is very nice. I'm also going to try to get all the ace coins, ideally, on this level. Oh, no. 
Get lucky! I like Peach's hover ability. It's really good. Not sure what the purpose of that was. <laughs> oh yeah! This is the room where if you're absolutely insane, you can screw yourself out of being able to beat it. You have to d destroy every piece of dirt, though, in a certain direction. Yeah, one ace coin left. There it is. Shy guys are just relentlessly pursuing me, though. You're gonna hover while crouched? That's interesting. Cool. Are we at the boss now? We are! Yay! Hi, Birdo. You're way easier when you're Peach. Or when I'm Peach. <laughs> Birdo doesn't have a great memory, apparently. Because she hasn't remembered it in the past. <laughs> Course clear! Oh yeah, and I can get the roulette now because I actually got the coins. All the ace coins. Aw, oh, stupid sniff it. Hey, one up. Cool. I do not condone people gambling, but oh man, dumb old sniffets. Well, I'm I'm doing pretty well as Peach. I think I'm gonna continue as Peach. Even if she can't jump that high. Oh, never. Well, <laughs> if you supercharge her jump, she can jump pretty high. I outran the thing that I threw. That doesn't seem like something that should happen. Like, I threw something, ran in front of it, and... Okay... Okay, that was the weirdest thing that I've ever seen. <laughs> Not the weirdest thing I've ever seen, but, you know. <laughs> it was pretty darn bizarre. Oh, no. Alright, fine. I won't go after the... I will not go after the, all the ace coins on this level. <laughs> Whatever. I'm, I don't care about 100%. That might be why I failed this as a kid so much, because I was like, oh, I gotta get the ace coins. I just went through a vase that had a snake in it. I don't recommend doing that in real life. It won't end well. No, no, no. Okay, this is the room that you can permanently screw up if you destroy every piece of sand. Get out of here, shy guy. I guess there's a lot of sand rooms. Oh, why did the invincibility spawn way far away? I need that heart. I need that heart. This is not Zelda, but there are hearts as your health, not mushrooms. Those are shorter than I remember. Oh, hi, Red Birdo. Yeah, 
Yeah, Sand and Shy Guys do not mix well at all. Darn it! I didn't expect her to shoot something like that. Probably should have chosen Toad since I'm at the end of the level, but oh well. you fairly easily, Birdo. I don't really care about your well-being. You're such a weird character. And you're trying to kill me with fireballs and eggs. So yeah, don't really feel that bad about that. But again, how in the world do people just stockpile so many lives in this? Also, I love the overworld music in this. Especially in the Game Boy Advance version. Wait a second, those are the coins that give you the roulette spins at the end, not the ace coins. I forgot about that. The way Peach says thank you is really cute. Oh man. Stupid fairies. Uh oh. Out of my way, pokies. Oh yeah, the pyramid. I think I'm gonna carry this outside. Uh huh. Best to kill both of them before delving down here. Uh, why did I not pick up the Shy Guy, though? I was not above Sand. Now I understand why Anakin hates Sand so much. He was just playing Mario in Vance. I don't think that's how doors are supposed to work. <laughs> Peach don't obey by the rules. Peach is the monarch. She makes the rules. Those shy guys are approaching. Just give me the key. And now the masks chase us while we jump up through the sand. You can throw the key to get rid of it briefly, but trust me, picking it up in all the sand is more trouble than it's worth. Why is he doing the boss music? Do I want to know? <laughs> A crystal! 
It took me a while to figure out that's what they were saying. Oh yeah, one of my favorite bosses. He has a cool voice. I can't remember what this guy's name is. It's like Tricycle or something? Oh wow, invincibility frames. Oh, wrong way, Peach. But I love your enthusiasm. Whoops. <laughs> Impostable! Alright, now we're on the world that made me give up. Specifically, Free Free, which made me give up because of the boss. Which is not fun. Hey, one up, cool. How is two sevens not worth something? Stupid sniff it. Well, Peach is definitely doing me the best out of all the players. I guess she's, she's like easy mode or something. Uh, okay. Sure, I'll happily glide up to the top of the Shy Guy's head. Whoop! Whoop! Oh, hi! You again! That's a dirty trick, Uncle Donald! Oh, hang on. Big Shy Guy. Oh. <laughs> Big Shy Guys can kill you if you touch them, but also if you throw them into nothing, then they just spawn a heart for you. I Jump, Peach! Don't just let go. I pressed the jump button. Game over, too. Ah, uh, well. If I had to have a game over, the first level in the world is where I would want it to be, rather than the third. The third boss just has so much HP. This is fun, though. I am having fun. Peach makes it a lot more bearable because of her hover ability. Even if she does not jump very high. She still jumps higher than Toad. I'm just gonna borrow this. Hope you don't mind. I really want Super Mario Advance slash Super Mario 2 custom creator in Mario Maker. I think that would be very well, uh, very good. Oh, what's down here? Oh, ha! Oh, that's creepy. She can't grab enemies as fast, that's true. While you're grabbing something, you have invincibility frames, so that actually can be a good win. Hey, you. I 
I ducked, though. Come on. Make up your mind, game. Uh, okay. That happened. Let's try out Toad for the boss. Oh yeah, Toad's much better for the boss fights. <laughs> Birdo's so incredulous, like, how could you kill me for an eighth time? No bonus for Toad. That's fine. Alright, Toad, thanks for your help. <laughs> thanks for your service to your country, but... Peach is back. Oh! I forgot about Full Mango Shy Guys. That's cool. This game is so quirky. It's got a lot of personality to it, and I do like that. And it's got cool music. It's definitely not something you'd get in any other Mario games. Honestly, though, I think it would be awesome if, like, instead of keeping constantly making, like, new Super Mario Bros, but this time it's for the Switch, things like that, I think they should make, like, a 2D Mario game where, like, it's gonna, it starts out, like, with you thinking it's going to be that, and, like, World 1, you defeat Bowser, and then, like, it's just, like, all heck breaks. Come on. I was gonna say, like, you beat Bowser, and then, like, you just go to, like, a bunch of worlds from Forgotten Mario games. So you'd go to, like, the Mario Land world. Uh, you'd go, like, <laughs> and, like, the final world would be, like, this, and you fight Wart at the end. And, like, he's the one behind everything. I think that'd be great. Like, you go to a world where you fight Donkey Kong, because Donkey Kong used to be a Mario antagonist. Like, I think that could be really cool. Break up the monotony of New Super Mario Bros. So how am I supposed to get through that, though? Like... The ladder is really picky. Oh, why did it cut off the other plant? How am I supposed to get through there? Because you can't take bombs with you down the ladders. Do you have to leave and then come back? But I think then the rock walls will respawn as well. Yeah. This is very strange. For real, Peach? For real? This is where being towed, I can see the benefits. For real, Peach? a tricky puzzle. Which I don't expect in a game like Mario. Could I have literally just gone along the top and hovered across with Peach?
I mean, I, I kind of like the idea of this level where you go, like, underground through the main part of the area. Oh, am I going to have to do what I think I'm going to have to do? Oh, I thought there was a pit there at the bottom. Thank goodness it wasn't. That would be a little too mean. Oh, hey, it's the hairy hedgehogs from Yoshi's Island. What are we going to do with you? They look like Sonic. Well, they're not worth dealing with. Uh, oh, come on. Okay. <laughs> there are parts of this game that are really irking me. The ladder climbing is not very good in terms of controls. Oh, there was a red potion in the hedgehog room. Birdo, you should be expecting this by now. It's not like it's the first time. Uh, what the heck just happened? I threw the mushroom step stool and it froze in midair. Oh, okay, apparently it can't be on the same platform as a turnip, so it just levitates. Okay. What ifs? Cool, yay. I got refunded some of my lives. Dare I ask what happens if you get free sniffets? All right, this is the one that made me quit playing. This is the level I never made it past as a child. I made it to the boss. But this is a very long level. Mega Pal Block. I like the look of this. Woo! Okay, so one of these doors leads to the key. I believe it is this one. And it just occurred to me I probably should have been someone like Mario. So I don't have to keep doing this charge jump. Uh-oh. I know what red means. <laughs> Oh, is this all just for an ace coin? Yeah, it was. Rats. Oh, and a one-up. Okay, that was worth it. Wow, Peach plucked that out real fast. Oh, hi. Alright, that was a worthy detour. Alright, let's find the key. The key is this way, I seem to... <laughs> this game is not very well designed. <laughs> there are quite a few glitches I've co uncovered just completely accidentally. Getting stuck in walls and ceilings and the like. Wait, I need to save those. I need to go down this corridor while carrying the key. I feel like this could be the structure of a Lemmings level here. And out of the jars pop zombies. Okay, um, nice job letting me jump there, game. Thank you for that. Alright. It's the great key chase. Why do the masks want the key so badly anyways? 
Oh, I hear my cat meowing. He's like, hey, have you forgotten about me? I kind of live here, too. <laughs> cool, cool. No, 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 don't go back. <laughs> no, don't go back, Peach. Or Toadstool, as you might be called in this. No, I don't know she's not. It's Peach. That's why there's a P next to the lives count. The ladder climbing is so precise. You have to be in, like, the dead center of the ladder. Yeah, my cat is making a, throwing a fit in the other room. What the? No. That stupid ladder almost screwed me up again. Come on. Give me a heart, please. Thank you. Thank you. I didn't need two, but I appreciate the generosity. Is this the boss? Nope. Yeah, this level's long. <laughs> yeah, Peach can cheese it. <laughs> what is this mystical land? Still not as weird as Daisy's Kingdom in Super Mario Land, though. We have things like Koopas that explode when you kill them. We're still not even in the last room. Wow. Oh, now we get the cherries. And they are indeed quite lucky. Alright. Peach is my girl. This game just made me like Peach a whole lot more. Oh, come on! That is not fair! I died because the screen transition made me lose my invincibility frames. That time I died because I was stupid. This level was too big. Especially, consider, this was an NES game. Oh, pow block. Oh, this could be great. I'm gonna save this. There we go. That'll help. Alright, come on, please be the boss room. Well, close enough. It's not the boss room. I outran the Koopa shell again! How does that even work? Alright, well, I'm close to the boss, so it's time to switch to Toad. Brilliant. Thank you! Oh wait, I should not be towed for this fight. It's Roberto! Yeah, it's much more glitchy than I remember it, too. Also, tell me, Nessie, is this fight in the NES version? This fight just takes forever. She has so much HP and she can just flat out of not shoot the eggs if she doesn't want to. <laughs> the red shuffling is a really stupid oversight, too. Like, just a little bit of testing would show you how bad that is. 
Because I don't think I've ever seen this boss in the NES version. Because I've seen people play the NES version. There we go. We got the fast egg sniper that time. Oh, no. Yeah, Roberto just has so much HP. Although, admittedly, the fight is actually really easy now that I realize you just grab the chain and she telegraphs her moves. Um, oh, that's right, the chains are glitchy. Whoops. Yeah, oh, no, no, oh, no, no, oh, no, no. <laughs> Come on, shoot me an egg. Thank you. Man, Roberto was weird. Alright, well, that's... Hey, I'm officially at the farthest point in the game I've ever reached. No coins from potions. Alright, well, I guess I'll give World 4 a try. I mean, might as well, right? Thanks, Proxima. Oh, no! Why? I could count the amount of good ice worlds... Uh, worlds with ice physics that I've encountered on one hand. Possibly on one finger. The only one that comes to mind is Allegro Presto from Rayman. That one is actually fun. And it's fun because of the ice physics. Physics are so bad. But who encounters ice physics and is like, oh, this is great. I hope this is a main gimmick for, like, every single, like, platforming game. The answer is absolutely nobody. Again, literally, Rayman, the original, is the only game I can think of where it had, I the ice physics were actually fun. Oh, uh, what? What the heck? You guys all saw that, right? Yes! In the nick of time. Oh, wow! Blast off, I guess. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> what the heck is going on? It's like an early version of General Guy from Paper Mario. Also, I don't know what the heck those gooey things are. Please give me a heart. Things only get weirder from now on. Weirder than Roberto? Roboberto is very strange. Uh, this worries me. Is this another boss level? No, that's just the course clear. Oh, okay. Oh, come on! That was so close. Well, let's keep going until we have a game over. That... No, oh, this... Well, if I keep getting one-ups, then... It might take longer than I'm expecting. No, no, no. Mm -mm. Nope. Uh-uh. Peach. Grab the Dane heart. Thank you. Watch me immediately lose it. <laughs> okay, I adore Peach's Hover. It's so good. It's so useful! I know I'm blatantly ignoring most of the secrets, but I don't really care about the secrets. I just want to beat this! <laughs> Peach is allergic to water. It's a pretty drastic condition. Either that or those whales are drinking a whole lot of Mountain Dew Baja Blast, and Peach is allergic to that. Blast off! Okay, this is like a space and an ice world combined into one.
Okay. <laughs> Get off of these. Oh. Uh-huh. And what, pray tell, am I supposed to do about that? Oh, I know what I'm supposed to do about that. Or actually, maybe I don't. Oh, there we go. I was waiting for him to respawn. Oh, no. Come back here! They're in my ride! That is hard to land on. Okay, I don't like this. I like it in concept, but not in execution. There we go. I don't want to call yourself lucky just yet, Peach. You died, like, a couple times there. Oh, hey! Birdo? Okay, Birdo on ice. Not not one of those holiday specials I want to see. In fact, I'm pretty sure that was ro voted the worst ice skating spectacular out there. Birdo on ice. Couldn't pay people to see it. <sighs> ice again? No! Oh, I'm on my last life. Birdo on ice, live. No, thank you. That's a big bag of nope from me. I don't like Birdo. Almost failed that jump. If I had failed that jump, that would have been the worst. <laughs> Alright, I'm just going on a limb and saying I'm probably not going to be able to beat this level in one life, in which case I'll probably end the stream when I have the game over. But that's not that's to say I'm not I am gonna try. Oh hi. <gasps> uh oh. Wow, that blended in really well. Um, hi, Birdo. Are you a common enemy now? <laughs> she answered for me. Birdo, are you a common enemy? No! <laughs> She's like, I can't have been demoted. Thank you for telling me that, Proxima. <laughs> I appreciate that. Oh, hey. It's the weird fruit. Peach has got it. Not sure where I was supposed to go on that level. But alright. That's Super Mario Advance. I'll be streaming that again in the future as well. <laughs> Thanks for watching, everybody. This is a lot of fun.